already know, we officially resumed our physical services on the 12th of July 2020. And since then, we've been employing the very best safety protocol in all our physical services in line with the best global practice. From our automated contactless hand wash and sanitizing stations to three levels of temperature checks, we have ensured as much as possible the safety of all parishioners. Now this here is our infrared thermal camera and it has the capacity of capturing the images and taking the temperature readings of up to 20 persons all at the same time. Now this here is our decontamination chamber. Here, worshippers are disinfected as they move into and out of the sanctuary. To make sure everyone is safe in the auditorium during service, the seats have been spaced two meters apart in adherence to the practice of social distancing. What's more, at the end of every service, the hall is further decontaminated ahead of the next service. Now with all these in place, you don't have a reason to miss church. Hello, God bless you. My name is Commander CSI. Commanding in the 21st century under high tension Pentecost power anointing, licensed to liberate mankind and devastate the kingdom of darkness. What a beautiful day. What a wonderful day. I have three things in mind to talk about. Number one, love. Number two, about our women. And number three about our men. Wow. <clears throat> it's, it's so amazing that these uh, are three things I want to really talk about. But I feel like picking up at least one. Maybe I should pick women. I just want to say to all our women, nobody's doing you a favor to marry you. You are beautiful. You are intelligent. There is something you have to offer. I want you to have it at the back of your mind. Don't allow any person to make you feel less of yourself. Be it society, be it a man, be it a woman, be it anybody. Marriage cannot exist without you, the woman. Marriage cannot exist without you, a man. Nobody is doing any person a favor by marrying each other. Marriage is a contributed effort. Without two people, marriage cannot exist. And I see a lot of women sometimes putting a lot of power, putting a lot of energy just to please this man. You can do anything you want to do to please this man. I see some men too putting some, so much energy just to please the woman. Listen to me now. Because this may interest you, your life. Your destiny is not tied to anybody. It's not tied to any marriage. We were created separately in a different, unique way. It simply means we can survive without each other. Definitely we can survive without anybody. But now when two unique people come together to create something special, that is what marriage is all about. Nobody is doing anybody. A favor. Marriage is a teamwork. M marriage is like a joint venture. No one can survive without the other. And we need to know that. We need to make effort to make it work. So dear women, if you want to succeed, what is that thing you are going to contribute? Dear men, if you want a woman around you, what can you add to her life? That is to say, you have to bring something to the table. Nobody. Nobody is doing anybody a favor marrying them. It's a joint effort. Let that be at the back of your mind and stop being desperate. I love you all. My name is Commander CSI. It hurt me to see you cry. Please don't cry. You cry for lack of knowledge. 
the Bible says my people perish for lack of knowledge. I don't want you to cry. So be yourself and know that all of us are men to contribute to each other. I just want to tell you, I love you from my heart of heart. And may the Lord God Almighty bless each and every one of you. As you listen to me today, heaven will create something unique around you. And you will smile in your marriage. God bless you, Rigo. My name is Commander CSR. They call me the Lord of the Caribbean. From me to you, I say to you, Asante, Maranatha, Onyewanyanabia, Shalom.